Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Arise with the Lace for Tea Games. On the last episode, quite a lot happened. Uh, we went into the quarry where we'd been asked to go by Miguel, and we were checking it out, seeing the fact that there were no laborers, and also the place was crawling with zoogles. And as we went through, we discovered that at the very end of the quarry, where there's supposed to be a hospital facility, there is actually just a very big, beautiful lake underground which was filled with the hollowing, which is what occurs when Adanan is completely uh, drained of all astral energy and there is no matter left, only uh, a weird silver goo liquid. <laughs> um, so yeah, Miguel sacrificed himself to try and convince Dohalim that that was the case. Uh, Kisara was very distraught. Um, Doholim was very traumatized <laughs> because of his past trauma and thus we had to fight Doholim who went, whose master core went out of control and then uh, after we left uh, it turns out that Kelzalik, Doholim's second in command kind of servant -y guy uh, has actually staged a, an insurrection at the, at the palace so we have to go to the palace uh, I did also get a bunch of like equipment and stuff. I haven't done anything between episodes. I'm really hoping that what we've done is already enough. <sighs> Guess we'll find out. Let's go. This is a terrible idea. This is a very terrible idea. I love that like that logo for the gold dust cats. It's very pretty. I thought we'd see fighting throughout the city, but it's dead quiet. Either Dohalim's allies have been arrested, or they're keeping a low profile. Meaning the rebels are occupying the palace? Then let's hurry up and kick those bastards out. Good idea. Er, uh, hi there. Excuse me, sirs and madams, I don't think you should be outdoors right now. A bunch of armored soldiers started attacking people out of nowhere all over town. We're bringing the injured in to treat them, but it's strange. There's some reddins that got attacked too. How does that make any sense? I hear the armored soldiers attacking people went toward the palace. I'd stay away from them if I were you. In fact, I strongly urge you to hide in our inn. Oh, I guess they're probably taking out Reddins who are sympathizers with Danans as well. Yikes. Hi there. I was suddenly reminded of the fact that I'm a Danan. I bet all Danans and Reddins in town feel the same way. Rena attacks Dana. That used to just be the fact of life. Yeah. And the moment it happens again, you remember just how much... What's the word? Inequality there is. It's awful. Hi. Oh gosh, I'm scared. Uh, don't worry, Lord Dolly might not be here to protect you, but I sure am. Really? Yeah, yeah, totally. I got this. Oh, no. Go and hide in the end. Hide somewhere safe. Oh, this is awful. Hi. <sighs> uh, pull it together, soldier! Oh, jeez, he kept trying to protect me from the other armor soldiers. Oh... Some of the Renans actually really do want equality. Oh, that's so sweet. And sad. Hi. They said to evacuate, but I still can't find it. Oh, all they want to hurry up- All I want is to hurry up and get out of here. And you still can't find the thing you lost? Dear God, just leave it. It doesn't matter. Oh god, they're still working their their stall. It sounds like there's some commotion at the palace, but it's business as usual for me today. Isn't that nice? Uh, no, ma'am, that's not nice. The soldier said there's danger afoot. Hm, a real merchant has the gust to stay open. If you don't like it, you're free to go home. Oh, for it. You know I can't leave you hanging after you took me on in off the streets. I guess I'm with you. That's the store worker I'm so proud of. Please go and hide at the inn. Oh my god. They have no sense. Oh dear god. Er, uh, oh, a soldier. Hi? I don't believe it. How could an aid to the Lord launch a revolt? Will I have to fight my own brethren? What's the right thing to do? Fight them. They're hurting people. Er, <laughs> uh, hi there. Welcome to the Sint. This city is open to everyone, even Danans like you or me. Or it used to be, at least. But now... Yeah, no, I, I don't think so Any at the moment. Yikes. Hi. Surely things won't go back to the way they were before. 
I know, I know, I know Lord Dohali will come through for us. Oh dear, he didn't seem like he was very, uh, in, in the right mood to do that. Hi. Is Lord Dohalim safe? I don't know. That's a good question. I'll talk to you in a second, Eric, because he seems like he's going to have a lot to say. Hi. A group of armored soldiers marched into the palace with a bunch of pop and pomp and circumstance. I tried. To, I just tried to ask what the deal is, but they said to go home. What's going on here? I see. Huh. I guess they're trying to take down Dohalim first, and then they can take down everyone else. Hi. Even the guardsmen got kicked out of the palace. What is Sir Kelsley thinking? That he's a racist? Yikes, hello. A, a soldier stood up for me when I was be in the danger of being mobbed. The other soldiers called him a traitor and hauled him off. Oh. Oh god. Hello. What a mess. This is no time for a sales pitch. It was all going so well. Are we really going back to what life was like before? Not if we can stand up and fight, which is a very dangerous thing to do. There's more people? Oh, I have to go and say hello to the other people. Unless they've not got anything new to say, in which case this might be a waste of my time. Hi. There seemed to be some argument brewing among the, ga the gatekeepers. Then suddenly, some other Renan soldiers came up and, the other and took the other gatekeepers away. It's like they see their fellow Renans as more of a threat than us. I tried chatting up the gatekeeper, and he seemed to be an alright guy. I sure hope he's okay. Oh. Wow. Yeah, I guess... Maybe they are more worried about Renan, sympath Renan sympathizers who sympathize with Danans, because they have all the technology and stuff to be able to fight, whereas the Danans don't. And also, they don't see the Danans as a threat as much as they do the Renans, because of the whole racism thing. <laughs> oh god. This is a game, huh? It's a very good game. I enjoy it a lot. Er, uh, hi there. Oh, Kisara, you're safe. The palace has been seized by Renan soldiers loyal to Kel Kelzalik. I've got no idea where Lord Dohalim is or what Sir Kelzalik even wants. The Renans aren't all on the same page either. There's chaos in the streets. For now, we're prioritizing the safety of the citizens. You take care of yourself too. Oh man, this is a mess. It's a great mess for storytelling purposes, but man. Would not want to be living in these times. Yikes. Oh, wow. Okay, if we go back this way. Also, like, what happened to the Master Corps? Did Dohalim take it with him? I'm slightly concerned that Kelzalik might have it. I don't know for sure, but. Hi. My boyfriend is sick, is sick and he still hasn't come back from the medical facility. Now all this is happening. I keep asking around, but nobody knows any details. I'm beside myself with worry. What's going to happen to us now? I'm actually kind of surprised they didn't figure something out sooner, given the how many people must have gone to the, the medical facility and no one ever came back. Like, surely you would think that was a bit suspicious, right? Hi. What we feared has come to pass. Denna and Renna are in a state of unrest after the remainder of days before... After the, remi the reminder of the days before Lord Dohalim's rule, the Gold Dust Cats will do everything in their power to carry on Megal's wishes. We'd better start by rescuing the friendly Renans. I'll pray for your fortune too. That's a good idea. Also, this book is very pretty. I just realized. Dang. <laughs> I got her a new weapon last time, so I forgot. It's very pretty. Oh, children, go hide. Go hide. Ah, I'm scared. What's going on? Where, why are the armored soldiers fighting amongst themselves? The big guy didn't even do anything. Why did he get taken away? Oh. Oh no. This is a mess. We need to go and fix things. Okay, there was that one other guy to talk to though. The guy with all the... Uh, he's gonna have a bunch of stuff to say. Hi! I don't remember what voice I gave you. You're all okay. I can't promise I know everything, but let me know if there's anything I can share. What's going on? Sir Kelzalik, the Lord's adjutant, suddenly occupied the palace and locked it down. But it doesn't look like all the Renans are following him. That's probably why some uncooperative Renans were attacked right off the bat. Is there anything else you want to know about? What's happening at the palace? The dead and guardsmen and uncooperative Renans have all been imprisoned in the palace. I've heard rumors of Zugal-like cries within. 
word, word has it that the Renans who still refuse to fall in line are beaten and taken elsewhere. There's no telling what they do to me if I got approached if I approach carefully, so that's all I've got. What will you do now? I'm talking with the guards, Mina. I just don't know what to do though. If only Lord Doholim were here. People are really over reliant on Doholim, huh? And Kelzalik? Sir Kelzalik is a very high ranking official. He's Lord Doholim's top adjutant. He's honestly never had a very high opinion of his standards. I was under the impression he served Lord Dohuli loyally in spite of that, but here we are. Well, the best place to take someone down is by right beside them, huh? Where is Dohuli? Lord Dohuli hasn't been seen since he headed for Razum Quarry. Available guardsmen have been searching for Sid high and low for him, but with no luck. Rumors abound that he's been imprisoned in the palace, or that he's already been killed. Personally, I prefer to believe that would never happen to him. Yikes. I'm good, thanks. Yeah, yikes, yikes, yikes. I don't have high hopes for Doholi right now. I Oh god. Like I said, I don't know where he is. Um, I'm hoping he'll eventually find the will to fight back, but you never know. Oh god. Well, guess we're going back in the palace, huh? Let's go. Oh god, this is gonna be a thing, isn't it? <laughs> This place is awfully quiet for a siege palace. Such a huge place is spooky without all those people here. They're probably waiting to ambush us. With so few Renans here, I guess this is what it's like when the Danans are expelled and the ruling minority are all that's left. My money's on them using Zoogles to even the odds. I don't even see any Danan guardsmen. The fact that they're not at their stations tells me they really have been driven out. We all swore an oath of loyalty to Lord Dohalim. My fellow guards wouldn't abandon their post lightly. Speaking of which, where the heck is he? How could this be happening? Any idea where we should go in the main building? Let's try the Lord's Chamber. Worth a shot. If you say so, Kisara, er, uh, I'm just gonna check. Who am I fighting as currently? Oh, I'm fighting as Kisara. Cool, okay. Err, uh, right. So the large chamber wasn't on this- on the first floor, was it? It was on the second, right? Uh, or was it on the first- no, it was on the second floor. So if we go up to the second floor then, I bet this place is going to be crawling with zoogles and guardsmen, but here we go. What the- that Kelzalik. Did he really manage to deploy these barriers inside the palace? I guess that means we're on the right track to finding him. Is there- is there any way we can get rid of these? If memory serves, there's a release mechanism somewhere. My guess would be inside his personal office. Hey Law, you can bust that wall open, can't you? Well, let's give it a try and find out! You sure about that? From what I hear, that thing can stop even a cannonball. On second thought, let's see if there's a release mechanism somewhere. <laughs> oh god. Err, uh, we have a, a skit here, an invisible zoogle. Kisara, do you have any idea just what Kelzalik might be planning at the palace? It's hard to say. I've never seen him use any powerful arts, and I don't think he's particularly skilled with any weapons either. However... I have noticed him accompanied by something strange from time to time. What kind of strange? I don't know. I couldn't see anything with him, but I could sense something was there. Probably some sort of zoogle. An invisible zoogle? We'd better be careful in any case. I'd rather we not find out after it jumps us and tries to rip our throats out. Yeah, that wouldn't be very pleasant. Uh, okay. So I guess it took us right outside of the Lord's Chambers. Right, okay, so... Kelsalik's office... Is it that one? That's an office. But I don't know if that's Kelsalik's office. Uh... If 
Find the release mechanism for the barrier. Well, I guess all we can do is go. And maybe fight? Hmm. Hi there, fight me! Looks like we got them all. God, I love how the music has been done in this game for the battles. Like, at least in these palaces anyway. Or the palace, the castle, and the prison tower. Like, it's the same theme, but then it becomes like a battle version of it. I love that. It's so good. It's so very good. This was Miguel's office. Not Miguel's office. Kelsley's office. And there are, are... Yeah, there's people here. Well then, let's keep moving. You know, Mass Devastation might be one of my favourite of the um, thingies. It's fun. <laughs> I'll stop your movement and I'll stop your life. We'll never stop being an iconic line. <laughs> we got the Noble Room Key. A key that opens the door in the Noble Room in Ottolina's palace. In Ottolina Palace, a room on the northern end of the second floor replete with lavish furnishings. I think this is a key to the Noble Room of the castle. A Noble what? The room at the northern end of this floor. Maybe the release mechanism is in there. I did think... I think I saw the noble room. Err... Uh, it was... Yeah, over there. Okay, that's not too far. I wonder if the enemies respawn. I don't remember. I think they maybe do. Or maybe they don't. Oh, they don't. Okay, good. I'm actually really glad that they don't. <laughs> that makes things a little bit easier for us. Err... Uh, though there are some guards here as well. Because of course, that's where we have to go. Why wouldn't there be guards? Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. I think these fights have been going slightly easier actually since we got um the equipment. That's good. And let's use the key. Ah, uh, fights. You people aren't supposed to be here. Really? I just did a fight. An opponent like this should be easy. You got spirit! Oop. Well, you hit the wrong person. I'll take you all on. Flare the Malisha! That didn't even kill him. I can carve through going in. Hmm. Looks like there's nothing to find here. Guess that makes this a bust. Got any other ideas about places we could check? Hmm. If it's not in his office, then I'd check the barracks, or maybe even the meeting room. Alright. Got it. Let's comb through both of those places and see what we can come up with. There are enemy forces here, too? They must be predicting our movements and deploying accordingly. So they figured we were coming all along, is that it? There's really nothing in this room? Oh, oh, there is a herb, okay. I was gonna say, surely there's an item at least! Okay, so the barracks are the meeting room. Right. So the barracks are there and the meeting room's there. Which means we're gonna have to do a couple of fights either way, really. Which is fine, because apparently these guys drop some valuable stuff that I can sell. Hi, fight me! With this, I can become even stronger! They drop peach gels! They drop peach gels! These guys are worth grinding, oh my god. I now have 15 peach gels, oh my god. Wait, how much health do I have? Oh, I actually could use a peach gel, huh? Er, uh, you know what, I'm actually gonna use a peach gel. <laughs> That's, yeah. That's probably a, a good idea, especially if these guys are dropping them, because that means I should be able to get some more easily. <sighs> Fight me! I won't rest until I'm the best I can be. Still striving to be on par with the Lord? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. That's fair. Uh, okay, barracks, barracks. They're over here. Fight? Probably fight. Oh, for of Helgen. Fight! Fight me! I knew it was gonna happen. Get lost. On the bright side, fights are something that we can get through pretty easy. Hi! I'm not the best at them, but this is fine. Whee! 
I didn't mean to use that twice, but okay. This is fine. Look at how fine this is. Ow. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. I feel sprightlier than before. Sprightlier. Uh, cool. <laughs> Interesting word to use, I guess. Uh, I see that there's only an orange gel in here and no defense, like no mechanism. So it can't be in here. It must be in the meeting room. Or they're going to tell us that we need to go somewhere else. Either or. Oh, they respawned. Frick you. Uh, I wonder hey, if I can... What do you say we fight that shining enemy? Eh? Oh, he is shiny. You're quite the gunslinger. I have to be, in this world. Don't worry. I've got your back. Oh, dang. That went well. Okay, uh, that's the entrance plaza. I need to go this way. Oh, look, more enemies. Nice. No scratches on my shield or my armor. Well, that's good. I don't see a release mechanism in here, though. They definitely said the meeting room or the barracks, didn't they? There's definitely nothing in here, isn't there? Wait, wait. Oh! Ah! There's writing scribbled in the margins. My comrades, in the event of an emergency, you are to disengage the barriers and go provide support. You know which room the release mechanism is in. Do not forget to retrieve the key from the office. Is that some kind of note the rebels left? Hey, it mentions the release mechanism we're looking for, but... This isn't enough to go on. Was there another note in the other office that I missed? In the barracks? I maybe didn't look enough. Err, uh, okay, hold on. Let's run back the other way. Err, uh, let's see if there's maybe a note there. Hi, don't mind me. They mind me, but it's fine. Barracks, there we go. I hope the guys in here didn't respawn. Oh good, they didn't. Err... Uh, is there a note in here? Ah! There was something on the shelf. There's writing scribbled in the margins. My comrades, once you oc occupy the palace, engage the barriers post haste. You know which room to leave the release mechanism in. Return the key to the room to the spe- Re Return the key to the room to the specified cabinet. Look! Another note from the rebels. If we combine it with the note we found before, then... There should be a key inside a cabinet in the office. Great. Let's see if we can find it. So we have to go back to the office? Or is this a different office? No, we have to go back to the office. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. This is a very back and forth kind of quest, huh? Err, understandable though. Like. Hey, look at that enemy. I didn't actually mean to fight it. <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. I like that voice line a lot. It's very cute. Okay, let's go back into the office. Okay. So a cabinet in here. Uh, is there a cabinet in here? I... Hmm. There has to be one somewhere. And they definitely set a cabinet inside the office. Ah! Here. It looks like a cabinet for storing keys. We got the duplicate Lord's Quarters key. Key to the Lord's Quarters in Ottolina Palace. This may afford a glimpse into yet unseen aspects of a Lord's private life. Even if Danons and Renans aren't on completely equal footing here, both sides still cared about each other. And now we have to fight some of those same Renans inside the palace. Don't forget, we're here fighting to keep what makes this realm so special alive. Don't lose hope, Kisara. Ah, oh, these conversations are so good. Okay. 
Oh, don't lose hope, Kisara. We can do this. All right. Uh, which way is it to the Lord's Quarters? I am facing the wrong way. It's that way. Okay. And I believe it's the last one down this way. I clicked on the wrong thing. Yeah, it's that one there. All right. I might as well fight these guards while I'm here. Hello. With this, I can become even stronger. I... We are getting so many peach gels. I wish I had more room in my pockets for peach... Frick. I, I didn't mean to use it on Shion, I meant to use it on Alfin. Oh well, I wasted a peach gel, but hey! Life needs things to live. <laughs> I'm ready for the next battle! I'm sure you are. Uh, that went pretty well. Let's head on in here. It's locked. Use the duplicate Lord's Quarters key, yeah! Okay, there's no one in here. There is a healing thing though, which makes me worry a little bit. Did that finally get rid of the wall? To think they would hide it in Lord Dohalim's personal quarters. The nerve of these people. They won't get away with it for much longer. Hopefully. That's right. Oh, whoops. Right. We have to hurry to the Lord's chamber. Let's go. <laughs> I really wish that there wasn't so much space between the um the conversations. Uh I hmm I'm tempted to go and farm some uh, silver dog tags. I only ha I have 18. But apparently they fetch a decent price. So I don't know, maybe it's worth farming yeah. a few. Uh Yeah, sure. Okay. I'm going to save. I'm going to go and farm a little bit. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and do that. But first of all, what's this? String scores to tug at the heartstrings. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff we can look at in here. The joys of music, concerto pieces for quartets. He must have genuinely really loved playing in that string quartet, huh? An eclectic mix of books on high-level academic subjects, gourmet food, curios, and more. The selection provides insights into the character of the owner. I, you didn't need to tell me that. I kind of gathered as much. <laughs> you wouldn't be telling me about it if it didn't tell me something about how Dohalim is. Oh, is that his violin? Why would you put it in that kind of a case, though? Unfamiliar in instruments are so on display. You can't touch them. I mean, if you're going to play your instrument, then why would you put it in a case like that? It looks like it's the kind of thing that he's maybe put away so that he won't play anymore. Do you think he doesn't let himself play anymore because of he could, like this friend? Huh. Anyway, I'm gonna save and then do a little bit of grinding. Err, uh, so I'll be back and I'm gonna sell. Oh, they are worth a lot. Oh, they are worth a lot. Okay, I will sell five of my peach gels. They're only worth 600, but I will sell five of them. Oh my God. I'll use that money to buy a few life bottles, and some apple gels. I still have money to spare. <laughs> oh my god! Um, some equipment. Some equipment. Err. Uh, okay, craft weapon. I have so much money. Err. Uh, oh, I don't. Uh, I can't get better equipment right now because I don't have the keen giga fangs because I sold all of them when I was suffering for money. Uh, okay, well, that's fine. Can I craft some accessories? Uh, Warrior Emblem is the one that I've already got on Alphen, I see. Uh, I could make a swift ring. Move escape speed. Uh, could get a Pierce Emblem. Let's get a Pierce Emblem. And we'll use... This one. And then I can enhance it using... What is it that it uses? I don't remember. Uh, What did the Pierce Emblem use? Wait, I didn't even look at that. Thorn Ore. Thorn Ore. I guess I could use a bunch of other stuff as well. Oh, there's my other Thorn Ores. 
Err. Uh, I wasn't. What was. What is it that I've got tons of? Enduro or Brimor? Brimor, I've got tons of. Oh, okay, I can't right now. Okay, but we can enhancement. Enhance. Right, okay, I can't enhance that any further. That's fine. Um. Okay, let's make it Enduro or then. That one has defense. And then let's enhance it using the other two Enduro ores. And then some of this Brim ore. Or what was the other one? Oh, other Enduro ores. I've got tons of them. Yeah. Okay, craft accessory. This is actually not too difficult. Like, the more they do this, the more it's like, ah, oh, yeah, I get this. Okay. Err, uh, paralysis resistance, wind earth damage. Let's get paralysis resistance. Because paralysis is really annoying. Enhance. Fleet foot crystal. I think I had another fleet foot crystal. Yeah, here. And then we'll use some of the. I have so many opal masses as well, and I don't particularly care for the opal accessory. Okay, this is fine. I'm learning how to craft things. Our warrior emblem uses brim war. Our decreased aggro s. Ooh, I'm curious about decreased aggro s. Fire and light curse down. This one, yeah. Uh, and then enhance. And these use the brim ore. So we'll just use a bunch of that. Get rid of it all. Uh, I think that's everything, yeah. What else can I make? I could technically make another one of those if I wanted to. Let's make a black onyx. Oh, I see. I can't even enhance. Well, I can enhance that technically. Oh, no, I can. Okay, fine. Craft. Err. Uh, I guess a shock charm, might as well. Rare drop rate up? Ooh. Err, uh, so enhanced shock. But that was using the parallax stone. Okay. Okay. This is fine. I am understanding how this works now. Err, uh, let's make one more of these, shall we? And we'll enhance it as well. Using the antidote rock, because I don't care about poison. Yeah. Okay, we're kind of out of money now. But, I just made a bunch of... Ooh! Okay, we got chic for Shion, I guess, because we made a bunch of accessories. Increased max HE. Ooh, nice! Uh, she gets a bunch of different stuff for that. Increased BG? Ooh. Well, I mean, that's never a bad thing. What does this do? Oh, this is a defense thing. I want a defense for her. Uh, doesn't she have spread already? Oh, no, maybe Renwell has spread? Do they, do they have arts that cross over a bit? Huh. That's interesting. Uh, cool. Actually, I probably should look at the rest of those. Um... I don't remember... Ah, here we go. 493. Can I do anything with that? I can. I can get Rising Falcon. Uh, or I could get... Increased near-death defense, yes. Uh, Rinwell. AG restored. Increased boost gauge. Strengthened magic charge. AG restored for critical hits. Let's get the magic charge. And then I can't get anything else for her. Kisara only has a couple of things I've not actually got for her. Oh no, she has more. That's uh, fine. Okay. Err, uh, in which case... Easier over limit. Yeah, that'll do. And then Law... Hmm. I don't know exactly what I want to get for him. Let's get... Increase near death. There we go. Yeah. Okay, that'll do for now, and 
If we look at our equipment, she's having the lucky bangle for now. He could have the warrior emblem. She's currently got resistance plus 30 on, which is pretty good for her. Um, this would just increase her defense, so I think I'll actually put the grit emblem on, like this grit emblem on her, because it's better. She's currently got an opal on, but she could really use the pierce emblem. And he's got a shock charm on, but the warrior emblem might be good for him. Although it does take down his defense. Um, although wasn't there an increased rare drop on one of these? Err... Uh, yeah, the shock charm here. I'll put that on him and I'll put him in the party. Err... Uh, for a little bit. So we'll move him in instead of Rinwell. Yeah, that'll do for now. I'm gonna go and grind a little bit again. <laughs> Seriously? Oh. Is this a joke? I think I realised what I'm thinking of. Uh, so there's a bit in the theme where it goes da, 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 da. and I'm pretty sure that's like the same kind of... It's in Final Fantasy XV I'm sure, right? There's a bit where it's like... Da, 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 da. Something like that, right? I think. Unless it's in Zysteria? Is this a joke? It might be a Zysteria theme that I'm thinking of. It just sounds like a kind of desolate thing. So it could be either, really. I'm gonna have tons of those astral masses, aren't I? Oh, I have 68 of the Astral Masses, my goodness. Hey, what do you say we fight that shining in? Yeah, the Astral Masses are getting sold. Right, how much can I sell these Astral Masses? Ooh, they are worth a bit. Well then, guess I don't need as many as that. Oh my god. This is a moneymaker. Let's keep 20 of them. Oh my god. I have money! I can buy items! Oh, for just day. Oh, I have 22,000 gold. I think we'll leave it at that, maybe. I will maybe save, just in case I need to go back and grind some more for money. But uh, otherwise, I think we're good for grinding. That's nice. I'm going to sleep at the inn. Because uh, I think it would be a good idea to get like a, um, a defense thing on. Uh, so there's defense up T, which is 90% 90, 90 plus to cooking. Or cooking effect duration plus 20%. Um, I don't... Oh, that makes the defense go higher. Yeah, do that. This should definitely keep you guys full. Thank you, Xion. Awesome. Alright, uh, the only other thing I'm going to do then is very quickly change over your thing so that you're not using the item drop rate thing anymore because I don't need that. Uh, I think the resistance thing might not be a bad idea. Uh, so we'll just get the grit emblem on her for- well, unless there's something better. I mean that raises her defense a lot, as well as her attack. So that might not- oh no, Allah's already got that one. Uh, that's, that's dumb, okay. Hmm. Oh, the black onyx would add a lot to her HP, but it would take down her resistance a lot. Uh, I think we'll keep the resistance one on, uh, and everyone else should be okay. Uh, okay, I guess with that done, let's go and actually uh, do the thing we're supposed to do. Uh, I just like the fact that I found a way to grind. <laughs> Um, that being said, we have to make this amount Looks of money like made it here in one piece. last us a while, so let's see how well this goes. Alright, with that grinding out of the way though, we are level 23, which is pretty good. And I don't think the level even matters that much. We've got better equipment, which is the more important thing. And we've got items, just in case. So, that's good. Err, uh, but now we should just be able to go straight into the Lord's Chamber. And hopefully not die. 
Fingers crossed. Well, well, if it isn't the slaves and the traitor, I don't remember giving you permission to enter the palace. So it's true. You really are the one behind all this, Kelzalik. I don't remember giving you permission to speak, either. Know your place, slave. Now we see his true colors. Yeah. A despicable excuse for a human being. Though really, I guess that makes him pretty ordinary, huh? Kelzalik, you were Lord Dohalim's most trusted advisor. His closest ally. Why would you betray him? Don't be a fool. I didn't serve him because I wanted to. I expect a mere slave would know, but there are many powerful contenders for the position of Lord. A contest of strength determines the one who will be Lord and undisputed ruler of a realm. There is no choice in the selection. If my master had any ambitions of becoming the Sovereign, I would have gladly served him. But he had no intention of fighting for the crown. Indeed. Can you slaves even imagine how that looked to the rest of us? Enduring the whims of an ambitionless lord, all we could do was wait for the end as we suffered through our humiliation. You want suffering? Try being Danon for a day. So you plotted against Lord Dohalim in secret. And when my brother found out... And I would do it all again if it meant returning Menancia to its rightful state! A realm where Danons are slaves and Renans their masters. It's the natural order. It's... Enough! Who are you to decide what is natural or rightful, traitor? Migal. My brother. He dreamed of building a world free of suffering. He gave his life for that dream. And all you've managed to build is a lake of death. You. You killed my brother. And now you'll die for it! Well, this is interesting. I love Kisara. Uh, she's amazing. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. First of all, I need to change my strategy because I changed it to no items and I forgot to change it back. Second of all, Shion. There we go. Okay. You should sit this one out. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Everyone has poisoned. Everyone is poisoned. Yikes. Okay. Eric, uh, can I use recover? Vanished again? Listen carefully and keep your eyes peeled. Oh god. You know, maybe I shouldn't have sold my poison wards. Oops. Oh well. Uh, recover law. Or not, because he's dead. He, he freaking died. Err, uh, okay, that's fine. Oh no! Oh, stop coming for me! I'm healing! Okay, err... Uh, oh! Someone already brought Law back, that's nice. I'm glad someone already brought him back. It saves me a job. Okay. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. I, does it say what level this is? 24. You know what? We're not actually that low level for it. I actually meant to heal. Ah! Oh my god, I saved him from death. Door? Flare the 
freaking nice. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, managed to dodge that one. Uh, does oh god, hello. It has a charge art, right? Uh, eh? That didn't work, okay. Oh, everyone keeps getting poisoned! Okay, okay, okay. Uh, do I have Panacea Bottles? I have two. Uh, or I could just, you know, use my Recover skill again. Uh, I should really just have it quick set, huh? Um, instead of Tonic Celestra, I'm gonna put on Recover. It looks like I'm gonna be using it a lot in this fight. Okay, oop. Recover, there we go. Okay, this is fine. Oh, we are going through CP. This is fine. Uh, get through his armor, please. Thank you. I picked a pretty good party for this, actually, because Brynwell uh, would probably have died already. Err. Uh, I don't even know what it's supposed to be weak to or anything. I can't see enemy details, though. But then again, I think they took that away in Brazaria. <laughs> oh no, I got stuck. Ow! The one time I don't dodge. Okay, this is fine. Ah. Uh, this is fine. Oh, I really can't heal you forever, huh? Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine, because you know what? We have so many orange gels. I don't mind using one or two. Okay, this is fine. Oh! Maybe I should use Kisara. Hmm. I- whoops, I didn't mean to use that. Well, uh, that's fine. Who said reinforcements? Was that Ridwell? Oh! Hello! Uh, hi! Did you not do that, thanks? Oh, hello bees. This is fine. This is fine. Uh, oh wait, he's already recovered. Okay. This is fine. By which I mean it's not really, but uh, this is fine. Oh, dang it! I missed. And I suffered for it. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, it's gonna charge. It's gonna charge. I if was maybe can... a little early. Or maybe not. Oh no, stop it! Stop it! Okay, this is fine. Ooh! This is fine! Uh... Oh! Oh no, okay. Law saving the day here. Okay, I need to heal. Oh, we don't have enough CP. Oh, that the helps, doesn't it? Orange gel, go. Oh my lord. Okay, this is fine. Oh, really? Every dang time. Oh, dang it. Oh, Law is very dead. Stop, he's already dead. I didn't mean to use recover. Can someone use a life bottle? Yay, thank you. The one time I'm actually kind of glad that they used that this helps. Oh no. I was late, I was late, I was late! Oh, that hurt. Okay, this is fine. Uh, this is fine. Okay, this is fine. Oh no, oh no. Oh, dang it, we're down on CP again. Orange gel, go. I just want to heal Law. Oh, for goodness sake, every time. Stop! Oh, I was too early. Oh, dang it. This is fine, this is fine. Okay, okay, this is okay. 
Can I actually get a, a skill off? Who knows? Oh, thank goodness I actually got to attack. Oh lord, all I've been doing is healing. I mean, to be fair, I chose to play the healer, but... Okay, okay. This is fine. It's dying, it's fine. Oh, ah! Kisara, Kisara! Ah. Dang it! I can't do anything because Kisara's not got her thing. Oh god. This is fine. You filthy slaves are despicable! Your dreams of attaining lordship are no more. Give up, Kelzalik. Attaining lordship? <laughs> Ridiculous! Only those who possess a master core can become a lord. <laughs> what did you think just anyone could do it? But then, what were you trying to accomplish with this? Didn't you betray your lord? Yes, that's true. However, there are other lords. Other lords? So you mean... At last, the truth is revealed. Doholim, where have you been this whole time? Cleaning up. Kelzalik, you've made your last of these. The fruit of Helgen? It can't be. You found my production facility? Correct. And I tore it down. But something still troubles me. It's clear that this is no ordinary fruit. Nor was the equipment used to grow it. You couldn't have done all this without outside assistance. Indeed. Something like this must have come from another realm. Mahansar, perhaps? <sighs> You actually expect me to talk now? At this point, the contest for the crown will be over soon enough. And you will finally receive the punishment you deserve for your weakness. I've already received my punishment. <laughs> May this be my final act, as the Lord of Elder Men and Sia. <laughs> Go. To Mahaksar, Ganeth Horrors. Wherever you think you'll find a suitable lord. Are you all right with this? He killed your brother after all. He did. But then I thought... He's nothing more than one common, ordinary Renan. He's not worthy of my time or my anger, right? <sighs> so after everything, was the dream of coexisting just a dream? What is that? Those are the cheers of the brave Danans who overpowered Kelzalik's forces. Wait, they challenged the Renans? Indeed. A militia made up of Danan guardsmen, Renan supporters, and of course, the gold dust cats. Do we have you to thank for bringing them all together? Regardless of what your original motivations were, your dream of coexistence saved countless lives. And now, those people out there are fighting to keep that dream alive. That's something real. Be that as it may, they do so now by their own hands. These people no longer need any lord. Where are you going? To put an end to the crown contest. So long as its madness persists, peace will remain ever out of reach. I cannot allow it to continue. The Crown Contest impacts far more than just the Danans. You're choosing to fight Lenegas and the entire Empire. I am well aware. However, if 
I wish to keep this dream from dying, then I have little choice in the matter. Besides, it's the least I can do. So, you're gonna go out there and make that dream real on your own? You may be decided on your path, but that doesn't make it any less difficult. Why not walk that road with us? Pardon? You heard me. We're fighting to liberate the Danans. You're fighting for the people of this realm. I'd say we're on the same path, really. It would only make sense for us to walk it together. Danon dissidents, side by side with a Renan lord? Not the least intriguing invitation I've received. An invitation which would only be proper courtesy for me to accept. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Hey, where'd Kisara go? I don't see her anywhere. Maybe she just needed some time alone. A lot's happened. That makes sense. She did just lose her brother after all. <sighs> we ought to keep moving as well. So long as there are lords who draw breath, we have a mission to complete. Kisara's a big girl. I'm sure she can handle herself. We should hurry on ahead to our next destination. I guess you're right. And it is a lot safer here than it was. What do you think, Dohalim? I am not sure I have the right to say anything as far as Kisara is concerned. Fair enough. Well, I, for one, would like to say goodbye if we get a chance. Let's keep an eye out for her as we leave. You befriended Dohalim. Kisara left your party. Master Core of Earth. The Master Core of Earth. The fruits of Helgen have imbued it with unfathomable, unfathomable quantities of astral energy. Oh god. She's Fonduris! <laughs> what? <laughs> melted cheese made by co made melted cheese made by coating the cheese in flour and boiling it in white wine. Most anything can be dipped inside of it for added literal cheesiness. Okay, so he's joined our party. Yay! And we got Dohalim's perk, Rod Extension. If Dohalim perfect evades an enemy attack, his senses become heightened and his rod will gain momentum, greatly extending his range. His penetration will also rise, letting him interrupt enemies and land critical hits on them more often. What's Kisara going to do now? I'm sure it's complicated for her. I'm sure it's very complicated for her, but also understandably so. We got Dohalim in the party though, that's fun. There he is. Er, uh, I'll add him to the party later on, but for now, let's look at the skit here. Kisara's disappearance. Where did Kisara run off to? You don't think she took off after Kelzalik, do you? No. Nagal entrusted her with his dream. She wouldn't do something reckless like that. Right now, I think she just needs time to think. What she does from here on out is up to her. She has to be the one to decide. <laughs> yeah, I think that makes sense, especially with Dohalim having done what he did as well. Like, Kisara has a lot that she needs to think about, I think. This room, by the way, is very pretty. Oh, it has water around the edges! Oh, with little fish in it! Oh, this place is gorgeous! Oh, I love this place! Look at the big throne, very decadent. Oh, these... This design is just gorgeous. Look at this pool. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with the design of this place. This particular area of the game has been the prettiest so far. It's so gorgeous. Alright, uh, I don't see any items or anything. So I guess what we'll do is we're just going to end off here because... We've been going for a little while, so hi. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Feel free to let me know down below what you thought of everything that happened in this episode here today, including plot, fights, <laughs> accidental grinding, I guess. Uh, that big confrontation against Kelsey, like all of that, yeah. Dang. I hope you enjoyed it. Next time, I guess we'll hopefully find 
uh, Kisara and get to say goodbye to her before we leave and head off to the next area. But for now, thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Hope you have a great day, night, or whatever the time is for you. And I will see you next time.